Okay, part four, last and final. I got the internet connection to go up. I'm wired with my iPhone right now, connect with a tethered internet connection. I also learned another thing. You go up in the corner, uh, it should automatically just get you in there. But you are online now as soon as you're wired to something, because I don't think it uh, very much appreciates anything else. So just show you it goes online. It works. There's Google. Now, um, for programs for this type of software, I we that's what's gonna happen. You will probably go to our, you go to our website and you'll have to download the, a newer version of Wise Chrome because it's an update for it. For the way updates work for Wise Chrome, because Wise Chrome is our new official up um, OS. Um, you'll go to Wizd. Oh, oh, sorry. Wiz Technologies. Wiz Technologies. Dot co. Dot n r. Then it'll connect to our website. And tomorrow, when we release Shadow OS, which is going to also be technically the same thing as this. Shadow OS is everything combined, and they'll have this type of environment. And what will actually ha end up happening is that there, um, there, will, there will be more tabs on the website, and everything will look much nicer. And it won't. It will say JH Soft. I have to give him credit, but um, I appreciate everybody who helped make this. Johnny Garris, Stephen Jacobs, JH Soft, and Andrew uh, Tom. Uh, what's his face? Um, Shoot, Andrew Thomas helped us make this. Um, I have to give him credit. He's our logo designs. That logo I just got offline. It's pretty, it's pretty sick for a logo, you know. Anyway, you know, I'm not interested in giving an example of gaming on it. Um, it's not. It's more of a business computer searching type of thing. But um, if you wanted to give it a game, you could look up. Let's give you. Let's get us LibreOffice. LibreOffice is much nicer than Microsoft Word, in my my personal opinion. I have it on my Mac. I'll sit download LibreOffice. It'll do it in a couple. Minutes. It'll take probably five minutes on this because it's tethered and tethered OSs are very, very slow, unfortunately. But um. Well, it depends if you have 3G or 4G. I guess. Main installer. Don't torrent. And if you don't have to, I don't recommend it. Shadow OS is the same thing as Wise Chrome. It's, uh, it's all Shadow is. See, it takes too long. Because I'm tethered, it'd take four, like ten seconds if I thought uh, I was on wireless. But I'll have to get a wireless up for us because I, I have I have the OS is already almost done. Shadow is almost done. It has wireless tools and it'll be really nice. Let's search in wireless tools right now and see if we can find anything. See, it won't do anything. Let's see if we can get anything up. There's there's that. It, that comes kind of off of Mac, but you know we don't have any wireless things on it. But turn it off. What you do is you go over. That's from Windows 8 type of thing. You hit power off, and it'll power it'll power our OS down, and it will always say Open Source when it boots up and goes down. So, yep, that's technically your basic instruction on on our, on our new Wise Chrome. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to rate or subscribe. Or if you're on WizTech, rock on.